Hey now, what's up dudes? Spider J420's Marvel Legends action figure collection. We're back with an update of ish, kinda sorta. I was gonna do another uh, shelf spotlight. Uh, I got some positive feedback on that uh, on the first time I did it, so I figure, why not, dude? Let's just do another one. I was gonna do a little different. I was gonna focus on my Mafex uh, figures. Do something a little different from the Legends today. I just rearranged uh, my shelf and I gave Nightmare Batman, uh, not only did I give him a home, I made him the centerpiece of my <laughs> villain's display. Uh, from the, from the, from the forgotten background to boom, right in the center. I've, uh, unmasked him and surrounded him and put him in pretty much the worst situation he would want to find himself in. But, uh, that's where you want the, the heroes to be, right? And I know I miss, uh, cross over both of my, uh, uh, universes, but I don't care, dude. Why not, right? They both are really sweet figures. They're all from the movie. Some of you, your head's probably about to explode, but, you know, why not? Um, <laughs> I figure, let's have some fun. Um, I could not, for the life of me, get Bane to hold, uh, his, uh, uh, ben Affleck cow, so I just put Superman's hand on there uh, because that's the only way I could figure out to make it work. But the thing is so big and it covers it, so you can't even really see it. And if I never said anything, you probably never even would have known. It's definitely small, that's for sure. But, uh, you know, like I said, unless you're really looking for it, you would never even see it. But, um, yeah, dude, all Mafex that uh, Bane and uh, Selena Kyle are, are, are pretty much brand new. Um, gee, you know, just like everybody else has said, I wish, uh, Bane was definitely taller, uh, you know, more in line with, uh, Deadshot. Deadshot is too big, Bane is too small, but, uh, other than that, uh, they did a great job, he looked awesome. And, uh, like I said, Selena Kyle, she's cool back there too, but, like I said, I wanted to finally do something with my Nightmare Batman, and I figured I might as well surround him, right, so... He's down there. Uh, my Lex Luthor, of course, you've seen before. It's just that Coulson Marvel Legends with the uh, Lex Luthor DC Superheroes robot body. Let's pop his head on there. Um, and uh, the Harley's my, uh, that's one of my few uh, figure arts. She's uh, not Mayfax, but I figure figure arts usually scale a little bit smaller, so I figured that would actually work out pretty well, and I think it does. But uh, yeah, that's what I got. Uh, that's what I got going on. That's what I've been doing. Um, and I found my uh, my uh, Mattel. Um, I forget if this was Return or Rises or if this was the Dark Knight Batman. I think it was the Dark Knight. But uh, one of the uh, other few Mattel figures that I have. But I figure I might as well put him up with the other movies, right? Um, and that's it, dude. That's. Uh, that's what I got as far as my villain so far, and of course I got my other few uh, Mafex figures, all um, uh, Batman vs. Superman, except uh, Flash, he's new, he's from Justice League, obviously. But uh, yeah, dude, that's what I got, man. I still love this Batman. I don't think I'm gonna... People ask me if I'm gonna get the tactical suit, or if I'm gonna get uh, the uh, Justice League suit. I don't think I am, dude. I think I'm keeping this one, to be honest with you. The tactical suit, I mean, you know, I don't really need it. Like I said, I'm totally happy with this one. And the black on black, I I prefer the gray. I'm totally happy with this one. Um, and this Superman again from Batman vs Superman and Wonder Woman from from Batman vs Superman line. I'm I'm keeping these. I got no complaints. I got no need to uh, update them just to get an angry head for another eighty or seventy bucks or whatever you're gonna pay for them. But. Yeah, so I'm chilling. I'm just patiently waiting for uh, Cyborg and for Aquaman. And my Cinematic Justice League will be good to go. So, uh, yeah, dude, that's what's happening. That's what's happening in, in my room with my Mafex figures. Right? Now we're all up to date. But, um, you know what? Speaking of up to date, I should have waited because I just ordered uh marvel legends uh from the lizard i'm slowly and surely built, putting my lizard together i just ordered uh gwenpool and i ordered um who else did i get i got uh prowler finally i think like 18 and 17 bucks so they were finally cheap enough i'm like yeah why not 
So I just need two more, which I think I might even just try to get the pieces loose. Uh, Spider Woman and Lasher. I mean, if I can get them at retail or below, I probably will, but I don't know, dude. I got no use for that uh, Spider Woman. I got the 70s one up in my Spider Verse display. I'd rather just keep her. But, you know, so slowly, slowly but surely, it's coming together. Like I said, I'll just need two more, and then my uh, build a figure lizard will be complete. Um,. Yeah, then I just gotta find a place to put uh, Gwenpool. I'm just pretty much getting her just so I can uh, put the lizard together. So, I don't know, like I might... Oh, I don't have my selfie stick, but... A Gwenpool. Yeah, actually, let me know what you think. Either I was gonna put her up, like, where the champions are with Miles and with uh, Miss Marvel and uh, Nova. I was gonna put her up there. That's option one. I was thinking of putting her like behind Deadpool over here somewhere, over her shoulder, reading the DC comic. That's option two. So that's an that's an option. Or I was gonna try to see if I could put her uh, behind uh, this Deadpool on the Vespa and put her with the X Men. So that's option three. I'm leaning towards option one, which is with the champions over here and putting her, you know, with the with the kids. That's probably what I'll do, but let me know in the comments, like I said, option one, two, or three. Let me know where you think she should go, uh, and we'll see if you win. <laughs> uh, other than that, like I said, dude, I think we're out. Uh, so vote in the uh, thing, let me know where you think uh, Gwenpool should go, and let me know how you like um, Nightmare Batman's new home. Front and center in the villains display. Caught, surrounded, demasked. Ready to get messed up by the Joker. Yeah, I have two Jokers, so what? <laughs> it should have been original Joker, Heath Ledger, right? And then they should have said somewhere that this Joker was Jason Todd, which was the Robin that got beat to death by the Heath Ledger Joker. And so this Joker's old Robin costume was the costume hanging up in the Batcave, right? To me, in my head, that's what they should have done. I wish that they would have, but nobody asked me. Don't you hate when they don't ask you? Like, dude, if you would have asked me, I would have given you the answer. Uh, anyway, all right, that's enough. I'm going to let you guys go. Um, uh, hello. <laughs> now that we're leaving. Hey, everybody. Welcome all my new subscribers. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, dude, I hope everybody had a good time. Welcome all the new people. Thanks to all the old people. Uh, thanks for sticking around. Uh, thanks for the comments and questions and all that stuff. Keep them coming. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to wrap it up. Everybody have a good day. And uh, we'll talk to you soon. Peace.